Hello, this is Alliance from DPRMS. Welcome. In this demo video, I will give you a brief description about what Microsoft Intune is and also show a quick demo on how it looks from the end user perspective when the product is being used. Take note that Microsoft Intune is very big and there are loads of features that comes with it. In this presentation, we will be focused to demonstrate the data and information protection features that comes with the product. Before we kick off, allow me to thank everyone from all around the world who are watching our videos. Make sure at the end of the video that you do not forget to subscribe to our channel as we will be constantly producing more demo videos as we move along. So what is Microsoft Intune and why would you need it? I'm going to be very quick here and go through the evolution of computing. First, when the computers were introduced, they were stationary and they were all Microsoft. Then we got laptops and the staff started to be more mobile and still Microsoft. Now these days we have all kinds of different devices and we are no longer Microsoft only. We have Apple, Android and other devices. Because of the mix, things are a little bit complicated when it comes to managing and controlling all these different devices. Another challenge is that corporate data are being stored on these devices and it is a little bit complicated to protect this data from falling into the wrong hands. To cope with these challenges, Microsoft developed Intune. With Microsoft Intune, an organization can reach outside of its perimeter and can manage and control these non-Microsoft devices. Microsoft developed the software in a way that it is compatible with the most common devices in the marketplace and since we are talking about protecting corporate data in this video, your first question perhaps is, can you control corporate data that is stored on iPhones and Androids? The answer to that question is yes, as a matter of fact. The next upcoming slides, I will show you how this actually works from an end user perspective. To do that, we have prepared a demo environment with one company, Nuvage, and one user, Dana Moran. Dana Moran has two devices. Both devices have been configured to be managed by Microsoft Intune. One of them is an iPhone, and the other one is an Android device. In this demo, Dana Moran has received a product launch document which we in this scenario will consider as corporate data and Intune has been configured to protect this data from leaving the company premises. In order to demonstrate the Microsoft Intune capabilities, she will at first try to save this document to her personal Dropbox which is not being managed by Intune. Then she will try to copy some text from this same document to applications that are not being managed by Intune. She will at last copy from applications that are not being managed by Intune to managed applications. She will first do this on an iPhone and we will then do the exact same thing on an Android. So let's get started. In this slide, Dana Moran has received an email from Wade Black containing a product launch document. She opens the document on her iPhone and she will try to save this document to her Dropbox. And as we can see, Microsoft Intune restricts her from doing this as the application is not being managed by Intune. Next, she will open the document in Microsoft Word. As we can see, there are no issues opening the document as Word is being managed and permitted by Intune. She will now copy some of the text and paste it over to her personal non-corporate email. And as we can see, Intune prevents her from doing that. Now she will try to copy the same exact text to her corporate email. And as we can see, no problems. She will now try to copy some text from a note application that is not being managed by Intune and paste it over to her corporate outlook.
as we can see there were no issues there. Let's move on to the Android device. As we did on the previous slide, we will now open the document on an Android device. She opens the document and tries to save it to her Dropbox. As we can see, we get an error message. She will now try to copy information from the document to her personal email. And as we can see, it is impossible to do so as well. Switching over to her corporate email, we can now see that there are no issues pasting over the information. We will now switch to an unmanaged memo app and from there we will try to copy some text to the corporate Outlook account. As we can see, there are no issues there. So what did we learn from this demo? For starters, Microsoft Intune is a very powerful tool if you want to protect your corporate data on mobile devices. On top of this, you can, if the device is lost or stolen, remotely erase everything on the device. So how do I get Microsoft Intune? Let's take a look at the licensing requirements. As always, to be on the safe side, ensure that you double check the pricing and licensing terms directly from Microsoft or a Microsoft partner as they can change from the day this video is being recorded. However, as of today, you would need a Microsoft Intune subscription, which are licensed on a per user basis. If you already have Enterprise Mobility Suite, then Microsoft Intune is included in the deal. Other than the licensing requirements, you should take a look at the what to know before you start Intune link attached below as it will give you all extra information you need in terms of the technical requirements before you go ahead and deploy it. We are near the end of the video and perhaps you have more question about the product which we are not covering in this video. Therefore, down below we are also providing you with a link to the frequently asked questions section in TechNet which hopefully will assist you in the best way possible and answer the questions that you have. So thank you very much for joining us on this demo and as always, it is a great pleasure to have you with us. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you will come back for the next one. Make sure you subscribe to our channel so that you do not miss out on any of the good stuff. Now goodbye and have a good day. Bye bye.